Jesus will come back the same way he went up. Acts 1 verse 9 to 11. When he had spoken these things, while they watched, he was taken up in a cloud, received him out of their sight. And while they looked steadfastly toward heaven as he went up, behold, two men stood by them in white apparel, who also said, Men of Galilee, why do you stand gazing up into heaven? This same Jesus, who is taken up from you into heaven, will so come in like manner as you have seen him go into heaven. Who will see Jesus when he returns? It says, Behold, he's coming with clouds. Did the angels say he went up with clouds? They did. Is he coming with clouds? He is. Behold, he's coming with clouds, and every eye will see him, and they also who pierced him. And all the tribes of the earth will mourn because of him, even so, amen. And every eye will see him. Now, every eye is every eye, because if every eye weren't every eye, it would be some eyes, and some eyes are not every eye. And here in Matthew, the 24th chapter, verse 30, it says this, Then the sign of the Son of Man will appear in heaven. Then all the tribes of the earth will mourn, and they will see the Son of Man coming in the clouds of heaven with power and great glory. Now, it's very clear. Acts 1, Jesus ascends in the clouds. Revelation 1, verse 7, he descends in the clouds. Acts 1, they see him go. Revelation 1, every eye will see him. All the tribes of the earth will mourn. And did you get the significance of this in Matthew 24, verse 30, where it says, all the tribes of the earth will see him coming in the clouds and mourn. So both the righteous and the wicked see Jesus coming.